On eight Republican presidential hopefuls getting ready to hit the debate stage tomorrow night. Former President Donald Trump skipping out as he prepares to surrender in Georgia. Our D.C. Bureau Chief Ben Kennedy is live in Washington with the very latest. Ben. Nicole and Calvin, as you were talking about, Trump will not be at the debate, but odds are will be a focus his criminal charges as he is set to turn himself in later this week. GOP presidential candidates set to face off in the first Republican 2024 debate Wednesday without the front runner. Our leaders are stupid. Our politicians are stupid. As former President Donald Trump will skip the event in Milwaukee. We got uh, the first debate in this whole uh, shebang. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis is among eight candidates that qualified, joined by former Vice President Mike Pence, South Carolina Senator Tim Scott, and former U.N. Ambassador Nikki Haley. But not making the cut, Miami Mayor Francis Suarez. After claiming he did qualify to be on stage. In his statement, Suarez says, we believe the polling requirement will be met by two polls that were yet to be reported, adding, I am sorry that this debate will not include my perspectives from the largest growing voting bloc in our country. The debate comes on the eve of Trump's surrender to the Fulton County Jail, indicted in Georgia for his alleged efforts to overturn the 2020 election. Under a $200,000 bond agreement, Trump will make no direct or indirect threat of any nature against any witness. That includes co-defendants like his former attorney, John Eastman, who turned himself in on Tuesday. My legal team and I will vigorously contest every count of the indictment in which I have been named. And again, Trump will be arrested on Thursday as we are now hearing reports this evening that his former attorney and former New York City Mayor Rudy Giuliani will turn himself in as early as tomorrow. Reporting live in Washington, D.C., Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News. Okay, Ben, thank you.